today's How To Tuesday, I'm going to be talking about our range of ADAX SDS rebar cutters. They're designed for drilling in situ reinforcing bars embedded in concrete and comprise of three parts. The first being an SDS shank for use with SDS plus hammer machines. The second being the fluted body to aid debris removal. On sizes 16 to 26 mil, the cutters and heads are vented to reduce heat buildup during the drilling. Finally, each cutter has heavy duty tungsten carbide tips, which cut through the rebar effectively without the need to add cooling fluid. Sizes from 10 to 20 mil come with a shank attached, and sizes 22 mil and above are available as a head only, to be used with our 220mm head adapter. When using a rebar cutter, it's important that you follow these simple steps. Step 1, when the rebar is encountered while drilling with a hammer bit, immediately stop and remove the bit from the hole. Step 2, with the rebar cutter mounted on the drill, change the drill setting to rotate only. Step three, insert the rebar cutter into the hole and drill through the embedded rebar. Always allow the cutter to penetrate the rebar at its own speed. Excessive pressure will slow down the cutting and risk damaging the cutter. Step four, after the rebar has been drilled, remove the cutter and finish drilling the hole with the hammer bit. So that's how to use the ADAX SDS rebar cutter. Once again, I must reiterate, they are to be used on rotary action only. Hammer action will most definitely damage the cutting surface, reducing the lifespan of the tool. For a list of RPM guidelines to help you, please visit our website. That's it for today's video. See you next week for another How To Tuesday.